little leaky gas tank cans we got from uh, our friend Tony here. How, how, how confident are we on this there, Miss what? Madeline? What? <laughs> Super confident. Super confident? All right. My confident, yeah. About they're going to leak or that these are they are 100% both going to leak. And they will also stay put exactly where they are. They may wiggle a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I almost lost my starboard quarter once. That's when I had to stop. It like legit was, yeah, I know it's fucked up, <laughs> but look at it. It's fine. Okay. It needs a little wiggle room. Okay. <laughs> What do we got here? Burn? Did we did we get burned? Oh yeah, we got it on Where fire. Is it? Here. Uh, so does your other we got a little work fire, burn, or is it just the one? Which one? I smelled this. Here, here. I uh, smelled this break. from behind. Cyclist. Yeah, yeah, totally. I was just curious. That, like you could hear it, but it's yeah. not applying any pressure. About two weeks ago, I dropped my motorcycle off in a warehouse to be crated up and sent to Alaska. Now I'm on my way up. I'm gonna meet the motorcycle in the warehouse in Anchorage, Alaska meet up uh, with a good buddy of mine and three other guys I have never met before. Ladies and gentlemen from the cockpit crew, this is the captain speaking. And I'd like to add my wishes for a uh, good afternoon and welcome aboard Delta's non-stop service. I honestly can't remember the last time I was this nervous for a trip. The plan is to ride the Alcan southbound all the way back home at the bitter end of the season. Probably with deviations around 2,000 miles. Pretty sure that's her right there. Yep. Ooh, baby. So the guy's checking right now with his boss. Apparently they can't take it apart due to liability. But I asked if I could borrow a screwdriver. Oh yeah. So I left here at like 16 something to get the bike and it took me two hours. A little longer than expected, but here's all the gear. It's all going on a little bay. Fuck. This is super fucking exciting.